Hello guys, welcome to Code with Anam. Today we will create an animated splash screen with the help of animated vector driver. So let's start with the demo. We will create this splash screen animation. Let's start. First of all, we have to create a vector file. I am using vector.com online tool. Just create a vector as I am creating. Follow the step. Now copy this code and rotate it 10 by 90 degrees. And assign them. Now select all. Duplicate them and rotate them by 45 degrees and arrange them. Now we need a hexagonal shape, so pick this and do this. Rearrange this and change corners curly. Now export this as SVG. Save it. So we have downloaded the file. Now we go to shapeshifter.design and import the file. So move all the parts in a single group. Remaining the last uh, hexagonal shape part, so we have moved all the parts. Here. Now we will change the properties of the line parts. First, fill alpha to zero, and we need a color yellow color code. So uh, copy this color code. You can use any color code. Uh, now weight to twenty and round cap to round, and a trim path start open, so it will not appear in the first. In the same way, change properties of all these parts except the hexagonal shape. Now add animation. So trim path start. Okay. Change starting value to 0. Ending value to 500. And accelerate, deaccelerate interpolator. And uh, from 0 to 1. Now observe this. Okay, so this is the closing animation of the path. Now we have to add a start animation for the path. So change this to 500, accelerate, deaccelerate, and from value 0 to 1, and shift it by 50 so that uh, path closing will be start uh, with some delay. So this is the animation we are looking for. Now in the same way we have to add this animation for the opposite path also but we have to uh, invert uh, this uh, uh, animation values in this case Now add this uh, animation to all the paths, all the remaining paths except the hexagonal shape. So I am fast forwarding this. So this animation is completed. Now we will add effect to the hexagonal shape. So first of all we have to add pivot. Okay. So our file width is 640 so center point will be 320 and we will be zooming and uh, adding animation respect to the center point. And the height and width of both are 640 so both pivot will be 320. Now add the animation. 
okay let's the animation i change this to seven fifty overshoot interpolator and from value zero to seven So we are uh, seeing here that uh, our shape is uh, uh, getting zoomed in before the line. So we just shift it. So this is fine. This is the animation we are looking for. Now export it as animated vector driver and save the file. Now just copy the uh, animated vector drawable file we have downloaded. So paste it in the drawable folder. So first uh, paste it in the drawable. Okay. Effector. Now we will see some of the errors here because this uh, an animated vector drawable is supported uh, after version 21 only. So we will fix this error. Now just press Alt Enter and uh, click on the override file in V21. Now we will delete the base file and uh, delete it. Choose No. Okay. So the error is gone. Now we will change the hexagonal fill color to white. Cream will not look fine, so we will change it to white. Okay. So now add an image view. Image view with height and width of 200 dp. And source as animated vector level we have just downloaded. So this is our file. Uh, make it more wider so change it to 250 height and width now constrain them in the center okay. now we have to give a id so animated vector now we will add image view with height and width of 100 dp and uh, we are using a logo here so this is our logo constrain it to the center of parent okay. now change the background color to brown i have already saved this brown color code now add a text view so Coffee, P O double F double N. Okay, coffee cup and text size to 26 SP and text color will be cream. Font family will be cursive so, and style will be bold. Constraint this. Uh, delete the bottom constraint. Delete it. Now change the text size to 36 dp. Yeah, it's look fine. Now add some margin. Margin top 10 dp. Now we will create animation vector uh, animation resource directory and uh, now create animation vector file animation resource file and uh, first we will create zoom in animation for the logo so set 
ड्यूरेशन ऑफ थाउजेंड एंड स्टार्ट ऑफ सेट ऑफ सेवन हंड्रेड एंड इंटरपोलेटर एंड ओवर शूट ओवर शूट इंटरपोलेटर नाउ स्केल फ्रॉम एक्स वाई वैल्यू टू जीरो एंड फ्रॉम वन and from x value 0 to 1 okay now we also add some fading animation so from alpha 0 to alpha 1 now create another animation use of file name it as slide in from bottom and give alpha animation so from alpha 0 to 1 now translate from y delta 20 percent to y delta 0 percent so we are now at duration duration of 1000 and start of the will be of 1000 1200 kg so interpolator Overshoot, overshoot interpolator. So we have created both the animation file. Now go to main activity or Java file. Uh, create animation references for zoom in and a slide in animation. Now zoom in uh, animation utils dot load animation, pass the context and uh, id r dot anim dot zoom in sliding equal to animation util dot load animation pass the context and id r dot anim dot slide in bottom we have to give id to them also id as logo and uh, id as title Again, go to main uh, change the visibility of all them to invisible so we are going to start our animation with a delay so till that time we don't want our views to be visible so change all the visibilities to invisible now find all the views image view logo go to find view by id r dot id dot logo and uh, image view any vector Equal to find view by id r dot id dot animated vector and text view as title equal to find view by id r dot id dot title so we have found all the views now we will create a handler so that our handler can start the animation after some delay okay so give a delay of 2000 means 2 seconds change them uh, fill after to true for both the animation now find the animated vector driver so animated vector driver driver equal to and anim vector dot get driver and uh, cast it uh, resolve the error as the if condition Now driver dot start the animation. Start. So this will start the animated vector driver animation and uh, start a zoom in animation on logo and uh, slide in animation on title. Now add uh, say change visibility of all the views to visible. Okay, visible title dot set visibility visible. Now create the second activity, activity empty activity and keep as it is. Now so our activity is created for now. Now 
we will create another handler that will start the new activity after 5 seconds so new runnable and we will create intent i equal to new intent from main activity dot this to main activity to dot class and the start activity and pass the intent i now add a delay of 5 seconds 5000 milliseconds so we have missed something we have to add a pivot in the scale animation in the zoom in so pivot x and pivot y to 50 percent slide in animation change this to 20% now we will make our activity full split so get window dot get decor view dot set system ui visibility and uh, pass thread as a full screen full screen layout underscore full screen and uh, hide navigation Now we will set our status bar color to transparent. So status bar color to transparent. Color dot transparent. Resolve this error. Press Alt Enter. To resolve this error, add a required API annotation as lollipop. Thanks for watching. So our code, all the code is available on our blog. Link is given in the description. So make sure to visit. And uh, if you learn something new from this video, hit the like button and subscribe to Code Vedana for further new videos. Thank you.